I got one more thing to say. Fuck West Virginia! Let's get right into this. Oh my god, this game was fucking phenomenal. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Fumble snap off the jump. And then... Listen. <laughs> this game right here was just fucking insane. By the way, what's up everyone? No introductions. JT Daniels getting out of the pocket. Just slinging that thing up. Got it. First down. This game was absolutely insane. You see what? You see my colors? And Keaton Slovis is going down. I thought the offensive line was supposed to be a strong suit, but instead they looked like the Pittsburgh Steelers offensive line. So I don't know what the hell was up with that. But yeah, he just went down. This first I listen. I first and foremost, shout out to ESPN, because they actually have the highlights out quick as hell. Oh yeah, oh yeah, good throw, good catch. 39. That is a pit first down. Let's go. Oh, play action. Play action. Oh, yeah. Move around the pocket a little bit. Yes, sir. Get in there. Get that first down. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. This makes me so excited to have college football back because, my God, the, pfft, these games are just so entertaining. This is like... There's no explaining the feeling of college football and having games like this, having rivalry games like this. There is no reason, and Keen Slovis just goes down again, but there is absolutely no reason why this game should not be played every single year. Why was this game gone for 10 plus years? I have no freaking idea, but that should never happen again. And this is Exhibit A right now. There. This game right here is in the exhibit A of why you do not you do not let this game go. And then you get CJ Donaldson, who's just absolutely torching this defense. At one point in time he was like five carries 109 yards because every carry he had was something like this. And he's a true freshman if I'm not mistaken as well. Thank God he actually got the tackle there. And then this was just a beautiful throw. This was a beautiful throw, JT Daniels. And then he hits you with the, the baby rocker, Bryce Ford Wheaton. This, yeah, just look at this. This was just a beautiful throw right in. It would have helped if the defensive back would have actually, you know, turned his head. Oh, yeah, good run. There you go. Nice little run. That's what we like to see. He's going to throw you down. It don't matter. It don't matter. Yeah, look at the. Hey, it's weird seeing college football in single eye formate or single, you know, single back formations under center. It looks so weird. I don't like it. And then, oh, my God. He, oh, 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 no. You got to hold on to the football. What are you doing? What are you doing? This is just not what we needed right there. That's what we needed right there. Let's go. Fumble. Fumble. And that is pit football. Give it to us. Give it to us. Let's go. Give us that ball right back. Give us that ball right back. You lost the football. Y'all just had it. Y'all just got a free drive, and y'all and y'all fumbled the bag, literally. And then get in there, get in there. That is what we like to see. Look at that place. This makes me want to go to this game at Acushore Stadium in 2024, man. This game just looks so amazing. A little sling pass, whatever, and then third and ten. Third and ten, and then they get a first and ten. We can't have that. Cannot have that. All right, come on. Come on. All right. And he's down again. That is the third sack that we have seen. And at one point of time, it felt like Pitt didn't have a sack for God knows how long. Like, and then... Yeah. Not a, 
the, the, the biggest disastrous way that you could start a second half that you could ever have. You go three and out, if I'm not mistaken. You go three and out, and then you get your punt blocked when you're... I just... And then he's just gonna... Oh, yeah, that's a grown man. That was a grown man just literally barreling his way into the end zone. My God. And C.J. Donaldson, the dude's just a monster, man. That dude played phenomenal. And then... Oh... This was the second time this game that happened. The dude is just slinging it up for dear life. You say, F it, he's down there somewhere. And that's the second time. We just had an ad break. That's the second time that happened this game. There's no reason for that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Get off me. Get off me. Get off of me. That is what we like to see. Let's go. Caden Slovis, you beautiful son of a bitch. 17-17. For whoever took the over, congratulations. All right, come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Give us that. Chunk play. Chunk plays. Oh, yeah. Oh, you gotta stall. You stay on your feet. You don't stumble. You're in there like swimwear, man. Oh, man. 24-17. 24-17, and another one by C.J. Donaldson. He just chunk plays on chunk plays. And then now there's a face mask, which was face mask. I'm not even going to complain it. And this was just a... <laughs> oh, that was dirty. Oh, that was dirty. Bryce Ford Wheaton. This was, again, exhibit... A, B, C, D, E, F, and G. Why this game should be played every single year. Great tackle. Good tackle. And number nine, I don't know why. <laughs> Listen, number 12, CJ Dawson is just dogging y'all. He was dogging shit all night. And then, and then this guy. Whoever the heck he is. I mean... They were just running all over like it was no tomorrow. And, yeah, this was, uh, this was uh, this situation. Yeah, look at this. Whoop! Get off me. And then he just got a free roam. Oh, yeah. I mean, that was a great tackle by whoever that was. And then, hey. He, yeah, he got in there. But apparently, at one point in time, they were looking at his shoulder, and they are like, E B. But, uh, yeah, 30, about to be 31, 24, you're thinking to yourself, oh, boy, this ain't looking good. This ain't looking good. Keen Slovis, oh, get out of the pocket. Eh, oh, my God. This dude's, and then it was at that moment when they went to that show, you're like, oh, shit, did he get hurt? Third and 24. 20, third and 24, come on. And then you go again. It was really at that five sacks to one. That is something that needs to be addressed. You need to get to the quarterback if you're pit. You need to find a way to get to the quarterback because that was uh, not good. All right. Luckily, you got the ball back. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh. Yes, sir. Good way to hold on to the football, too, because that could have easily been a disastrous play if they would have got that stripped. All right, come on. Get off me. Get off me. Oh, yeah. Get in there. Get in there. That's a touchdown. Let's go. My God, to the house. This is what it's all about. This is what it's all about. Pick. Pick six. He is gone. Touch down. Look at that place. That place is. I. That place. The, if there was a roof that was popping off, it was literally going to be like the Metrodome. That thing was going to boop. It was going to literally break or something. Because. 
And then... Good throw. Good throw. First and 15. That was a huge play. <laughs> That was a huge, that was a big time throw. I you have to give him credit. That was a big time throw. Oh yeah, that's how you get to the quarterback. It's like that. In the crucial moments of your biggest game, that is what you do. Third and ten, get to him again. Get to him again. That's what you like to say. My God. I might legitimately, well, I was going to say, I might legitimately lose my voice. I probably will be fine. Fourth and 16, the final play, and <laughs> at that moment, I was like, oh my god, there is no way. <laughs> Look at him. They are going absolutely nuts. This was a hell of a game. Exhibit A for the third time why this game should be played every single year. Thank you everyone for tuning in. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you guys did, smash that like button, hit the rest, subscribe button, drop a comment. We're now officially, well, 2-0 in games that we've reacted to with the Pitt Panthers. This was the first one I actually did watch. The last one I did, the ACC Championship game, I didn't get to watch that game. But... Hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. Stay safe. If you guys are going out partying for Labor Day or for your favorite college football team, stay safe. Don't drink and drive. If you need to, go and get an Uber. Uh, not sponsored. But you guys have a great weekend. Stay safe. Hail to Pit. Peace out. <laughs>